Hi, Carl Kratz here. I am at 91 River Bend, and let's go ahead and take a look at this property. It sits on 1.9 acres. It is a 1,066 square feet of heated cooled space, and then there's additional store or unconditioned space, and there's an RV included, all for 269. So we have, let's see, there's a brick facade out here. Go ahead, and go, go ahead and go in. There's spray foam up in the attic. Uh, you see the air conditioner and the roof were put in in 2017. So that's a tile floor throughout. Now it has an eclectic backsplash. I honestly, in my opinion, I'd take the kit, I'd re do redo the kitchen. Now we have a place for the washer and dryer right here, or you could do something else. There you got a little pantry. There are no doors on any of the closets. HVAC was replaced in 17. I don't know that I said that, 2017. Not that it's exciting stuff, but there you go. The fabulous spa-like bathroom, yeah. Here we go. There you go. Nothing special, but you can make it cute. Let me get that off. Let's see, bedrooms. Here's the first one, let me go get that light. Okay, about a right closet, a little hard to see. Closet. Next bedroom. Okay. Closet. And the third one. I would say this is probably, even though it's not like considered a primary, it has the biggest closet, so I would say that this is it plus it's in the back okay so we got that and let's see you know one thing i also like this uh ship lot look that they added so that's kind of cool all right let's keep rolling now the road out here is a dirt road before I go, I'm, I am missing stuff. Let's see, I know. Probably hit the wrong switches. Got that. That over there. And show you out here. So, this has got like a little storage area. They actually have a toilet back there that is not functioning. I think you need a new toilet. But it's not heated and cooled space. And then you can walk out onto this. Like brick veranda or whatever that's unfinished that you could do something with. <laughs> All right, we're out. Hey, you got a cute little swing if you want to swing. And let's check out the RV. I think they were using it maybe for a short-term rental. You know, I don't know where the lights are in here. So I apologize this isn't coming out a little better. Okay, there you go. All right.
anyway let me do this so you can see there you got the road along here the property line actually goes on part of that road then it goes back in the woods away there's actually what's going to be a cow farm cow pasture on the other side of these woods this used to be where there was a storage building so you could add you know you could put another one there do whatever you want and that property that's where the grass isn't cut is also part of the 1.9 acres now you can see the brick structure right there that is the pump so the property line goes back roughly i want to say like another 30 feet or so i'm thinking well actually i can see what looks like a flag so i'm walking back a bit so there's a fence i don't know if you can see it let me zoom so you can see there's a that orangish thing is the flag so that's the back of the property. So, I mean, it's a beautiful tree. Nice and peaceful, country living. You're 35, 40 minutes from Bluffton. The RV is hooked up to water, sewer, and electric. So that, that's pretty much ready to go. So if you have any questions, please give me a call. Carl Kratz with Century 21, 843-247-9373. And have a fantastic day. Thanks.